Yo, what's up guys, it's your boy Rox again here, back again, and well, like I said, today we're gonna talk about the ranked update, what will come and what you can expect from the third year to happen. Stop it, thank you. But yeah, today we're gonna talk about it. First of all, why it's happening, and it's pretty simple. We have three ranking systems at this point. We have levels, which, by the way, watch a video if you haven't already. Then we have PvP rank, which is the most important and most respected rank you can get. It pretty much shows what, like, how much time you put in. Then we have training rank, which doesn't really work anymore. From what I remember, from what I know, training rank, uh, in the old lobby, there used to be an NPC you could get your training rank from. It pretty much just showed how much PV training you did, even though aimless training is a meme regarded in itself, in my opinion, because um, playing grid joke 60 billion times over isn't really something you should do, generally, because it will hurt you more than it help. Then we have... And yeah, these are the three leveling systems. And they got confusing because PvP, like, your PvP rank scales differently from your uh, levels. You get, like, you can get levels faster than your Paragon rank. So that's why they want to rework it. Which I think is pretty good. But of all, it'll refresh something. And next on is the, like, how they want to do it. We have, like, like I said in my update video, we have two weeks. We have around, yeah, we have two weeks till the 30th, to the next, to the Friday, till the updated. And after that, uh, your rank will be nuked. Like, yeah, our rank will just be gone. Because they want to make it so that ranks actually mean something. Because at this point, you could, you can theoretically get a Paragon rank without even killing someone. Because you still get XP. It just takes longer for some for some more people than others. So yeah, then yeah, this is pretty much why they wanna do it. Just because ranks are they mean they mean more playtime over than actual skill, which I agree. There's some paragon people that shouldn't be paragon in my opinion. Sorry to say it like that, but that's true. Then and how it will happen is pretty simple. Like I said, third if rank is set. Everyone will be set back to bronze or whatever the new ranking system will be. I think it's gonna be based on... It's either gonna be based on levels or ranks. There isn't really that much sure. There, had, there is a playtest going on. The thing is, I couldn't get into it because... Yeah, the playtest is just dead. No one actually ever plays it. And I probably missed the phase where they tested it out. So, yeah. But, anyways... Yeah. Anyways, next, in the next game, I'm gonna talk about how and what you will get for your new ranks and how this will work. Second round. Next one is, basically, till June 30th, you can grind your ranks. So, be sure to get Paragon before June 30th. Pretty simple, right? And the rewards will be, basically, if you're silver and gold, and like silver, gold and below, you get 5,000 aim bucks. By the way, this always applies for all tiers. So, Paragon 1, Paragon 2, Paragon 3, and Diamond 2, Diamond 3, and so on. It will, it will, the place for all ranks. First of all, silver and gold will just get 5,000 aim bucks, so it's nothing much. But then we have stuff like um, diamonds will get a diamond lance and a unique kill card. I think you guys can see all this here. Paragons will get a unique, will get Paragon gloves, a kill card, and for the like six people, six, maybe eight people that will have a myth at the end of this uh, ranked season, we will get, will have a maze. And yeah, they will have a maze and also a kill card. They look pretty nice. I'm really excited about like how the gloves will work. But yeah, even though I must say the diamond net is also nice. And also, if you have Paragon, if you reach Paragon, you will get every reward below that. So we will also get 5k inbox no matter what we do. These people, man. Anyways, yeah. This is pretty much how it will work. And, uh, and they're gonna test it out. And if it works well for them, we, we can expect to have it in like seasons. Like season, this will be probably be like pre-season or, like or like alpha season. Out of pumpkins, unfortunately. But yeah, this is pretty much how it will work. Let's see if it covered everything. I have this, I have a screenshot of the, like, how the update works uh, on my second screen. So pretty much, these will be the rewards, like I said. Then we have, like, wide will it. It should reflect skill, obviously, and not just, like, playtime. Which I think is uh, valid because, yeah. Ranks in this game are screwed over because, in my opinion, some people just don't deserve Paragon. 
even though everyone can get it, I don't think a lot of people deserve it. Like, it should be for, like, good players. And obviously, Muff is for the people that are just, like, insane. There are some insane uh, Korean players and insane Chinese players. So, yeah. There's just some insane players. This guy is literally just trying to trip us. You know, I hope he knows how we win, though. If he isn't careful that we win this. This guy is crazy. This guy is going absolutely bonkers. But yeah, I think this is everything we needed to cover. This guy. He's actually launching the rocket and getting out of there. Uh, that, that, that's crazy. Aim blocks, please fix. Even though I won this anyways, because he's dumb. Well, yeah. I think... If I think, let's see if I have anything else to talk about. Yeah, I think I covered everything. We covered, like, why it's happening, how it's gonna happen, the rewards. Yeah, I think that's pretty much everything we really have to cover on this update. So, I'm just gonna skip this king, this, to, I'm gonna skip through this till the lobby, till the run is over. Alright, this was way too painful to wait. This was, like, one minute of 30 of boring going well. Anyways, we see us straight in the third round. Alright, here we are. Probably in the last round. But yeah, I think we covered everything we wanted to. So, now you know, so now you know about as much as everyone else does. Or, like, how much you need to know about the update. Which I think is quite fine. I like the idea to make ranks more meaningful. Time for me to be gold hard stuck. XD. But yeah, it would definitely shift around the meta a bit. I would assume we're also gonna get a, like a lot of weapon balancing is what I assume. I can't be sure, so everything I'm gonna say is take it with a grain of salt, except the rank update, that is confirmed. Well, I think we probably will also get a lot of uh, weapon balancing because in my opinion, you can cheese a lot of this game with stupid stuff. Like, I said it once before and I will say it again. Uh, in my opinion, explosives need to be nerfed heavily. You need to be heavily nerfed because, in my opinion, like half the players in this game use explosives. Like a, a large amount of high-ranking players use explosives, and I think it's a cheese because I think, like I said, I think punch boosting is for most people enough. Like, and, and if they keep uh, keep um, explosives, because I know they will, because the community outcry would be just too big, and that's also how they make a lot of money probably by people trying to get China lakes and buying cases for that. So yeah. Also, I got a phantom hit again. Oh, this is vampire. Okay, then I don't have to give a crap. Great. And like I said, I also want a better indicator for if it's a, a random thing, if it's a modif modifier. Mutator, I oh, keep calling them modifiers because that's literally what they are to me. Because that's what they technically are. But yeah. This is pretty much how it will go. But yeah, anything, anyways, I guess I'll have a nice day. And if you keep watching, thank you very much. I appreciate you guys helping me out. I mean, every view in this, every view you guys give me helps me out a ton. So thank you guys very much for the support. We also like, also very much thank you guys on the support and the opinions on the subtitles. I will try to make them a little bit better, more like every other YouTuber does them. Just the thing is, I use an AI to translate my uh, to translate my subtitles because I don't have the money to like getting a translator to transcribe it for you is expensive. Okay, more or less expensive. It's not really expensive. It's just annoying to do, and I don't have any money. If I survive, okay, yeah, okay, I survived it somehow, that's good. And also my audio is, my audio is delayed once again for some weird reason. I don't know why Ablox does this, but yeah. I don't really have anything to talk about. I wanted to just guys, let you guys know everything about the update. Alright, if you didn't already, make sure to join my Discord. There's a lot where I talk about a lot of stuff. But anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and also subscribe. There's a lot of content coming our way the next two weeks. Especially with the rank grind, or the rewards and stuff like that. And obviously the kill card grind. But anyways, I hope you guys all have a nice day. I'm Rosun's Conviker, and we'll see you straight in the next one. Ciao, ciao!